Well, good morning, everybody. Oh, it's a rainy day in paradise, which is fine. That's what keeps everything green. Yeah, we need a little bit of rain. And that's okay, because Goofy Doc likes the rain. George! Doc! Yep! You okay, buddy? He said, yeah, Dad, I'm fine. It's raining. Yeah. For all the people that sent George get well soon wishes, George is fine. Yes. George. Yeah, are you doing okay? He said, yes. Anyway, I woke up at 4 o'clock this morning. Slippy was giving me kisses. She crawled up on the bed and was giving Dad kisses just like she did for Jerry. Yes. Yep, she's a sweetheart. Now, I remember a lot of people saying, Oh my God, you can't have a ferret running around with birds. Slippy is a sweetheart. She doesn't attack anybody, and she didn't attack George. Layla's a sweetheart. She kisses George on his face. She has never, ever bit him. And Hazel was outside with me at the time George had his accident here by himself inside the house. I don't know what he did. Yes, and I don't know how he did it. I'm only assuming that he was attacking my crock and stuck his own flipper nail into his eyeball. But, right now, his eye is a little sore, but it's not infected. I will be going to Tractor Supply today, and I will get something that I can put in his eye to guard against infection, but he's using his eye, yes, it's just sore, yeah, he has two sets of eyelids, yep, and he may have damaged one set of eyelids, but anyway, George, George, you okay, yes, anyway, George is going to be fine, thank you for all the thoughts and prayers for him, Yes, but I just wanted to nix all the people that were saying, oh, it must have been Slippy or it must have been Hazel or whatever. I don't know how he did it, but I think he did it to himself. That's my best thought on it. Anyway, Limo and Emu and Timu just walked away. They were right down in there a little while ago. And Slippy's being a mischievous little ferret this morning. You trying to open my crackers? Oh, you're goofy. Yeah. Now, this channel is designed around entertainment, making people smile and happy. Yes, I heard from a bunch of vegans in the comment section that they've been vegans for years and they respect my <laughs> my choice to not be a vegan. A lot of them are vegans, but their families are not, etc., etc. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I love you all, too. Yes, everybody's welcome here, huh? Yes. George doesn't care what color you are, who you pray to, who you vote for. We don't care about any of that stuff. Everybody's welcome. We want to share smiles with everybody that could use one because we got extras. Yes. Anyway, for all the people that say, oh, you got to take them straight to the vet. <laughs> I need to let you know. We have a huge vet clinic here. You can get your cow, your goat, your horse, anything fixed. It's a big, beautiful, brand new building on my way to Hayward. I got to drive right by it. And they know George and they know the duckies out there. Remember when I first got the duckies, they had eye infections. Yes, I took them to the vet for eye infection medicine. And that was like over $300. And it wasn't an emergency. It was just something. I took them in there to have the vet give them something for it. If I took George in there all bloody, yeah, 
the, it would have been a $500 bill. Yeah, well, I'm going to say, just for the record, the pants I was wearing to work yesterday, that's what I was wearing. Yeah, and that's not styling. <laughs> I didn't pay $80 for them like that. That's hard work that got them like that. And I don't even know if I can save them as shorts. Yeah. Anyway, today I'm wearing better pants <laughs> for work. I have several other pairs of jeans that are even in better shape. Yeah. But I'm on a budget. Until I get my wife home, <laughs> I'm on a budget. And sending out offers trying to hire immigration lawyers is going to have me eat ramen noodles if I'm successful and get one. Yeah, I'm eating ramen noodles as it is. Thank you, thank you, thank you to Greg and Barbara and all the people that help us with extra. That makes a difference between me eating just straight ramen noodles and last night I added my leftover pork loin to my ramen noodles. Yes, that makes a big difference. And Slippy says, I want to get down. Yes. Anyway. The duckies have not killed any chickens. The duckies have not killed themselves. Ever since I started this channel, I've been getting lots of advice from a lot of people telling me, oh, you can't have the duckies in with the chickens. And the duckies, you got to get rid of two of them because three of them will kill each other. Yep. Well, Everybody's alive and well in Paradise Creek. Yes. It's just a rainy day, but the sun's going to pop out pretty soon. Hi, George. Hi, George. Yeah, he said, you bet, Dad. See his eyes open? Yes. The Goofy Duck is alive and well. Yes. I just thought I would let you know that. Anyway, I made a video of that big snapping turtle out there in the middle of my driveway last night. I made a 58 second video, so I'll upload that. Yes. <laughs> I don't know why, but they decide that they should dig their nest in the hardest possible spot. The driveway is solid rock. And that's where she decided to make her nest. And she was so exhausted, I didn't have the heart to move her. I wanted to move her into a softer spot. But she'd just go right back anyway. So, anyway, I went out this morning. And she was unsuccessful in making a hole. And went off and made a nest somewhere else. I don't know where yet. I haven't found it. But she gave up in the middle of the driveway. Yeah, she was exhausted. George, are you okay, buddy? Daddy loves you. Mommy loves you. The whole world loves you. Yeah. Anyway, the three musketeers, the three stooges, everybody's on runabout this morning. Now there's the musketeers out there in Henry's domain, but Henry doesn't bother them. They are their own clan. And these goofy ducks... Yes. Anyway, love you all. I hope everybody enjoyed the videos I made yesterday. This is what we love about this place is everything is safe here. And they know it. Yes. Anyway, I'm going to have blue skies in about two hours. It's supposed to start clearing up. And in about three hours, it's going to be nothing but blue skies. So that'll be good. But I got to go to work. Love you all. You betcha. Remember, stay safe. Wash your flippers off and thoughts and prayers for everybody that needs them. Oh, thank you, Mo. You bet. Love you. Bye.